again, my name is Gabe Zolna. This is the 13th of February, 2019. Wiley, all the way from the Far East, sent me another rather interesting comment, along with a link. And uh, I took a look at it. The title, Jeff Gannon, Male Prostitute. Hmm. If you've been watching my videos for the last two days, you know who Jeff Gannon is. Uh, it received 60,128 views. It was put up September the 30th, 2006, by Baron de Rothschild. Hmm. Now, you want to take a listen to what's said in this attached video. It's Bill Maher. And Bill Maher sort of jokingly talks about Jeff Gannon being a male prostitute in the White House under George W. Bush. Now Jeff Gannon has a press pass. The only way you get a press pass is once you're cleared by the Secret Service and the FBI. What does that tell you? What that tells you is that Jeff Gannon has friends in very high places, like in the White House. It shouldn't come as a big surprise, considering that we've already learned that his father, Herbert Walker Bush, seemed to indulge in that kind of activity as well, as did, from what's been reported, Ronald Reagan. And we sure as hell know that Barack Hussein Obama likes to bend men over backwards. Folks, this whole thing is absolutely insane. Bill Maher sort of makes jokes about it. And Lisa Stahl, who's a 60-minute correspondent, she highlights the fact that Jeff Gannon couldn't have reached the White House the way that he did with a press pass without being favored by the sitting president, which was, at that time, George W. Bush. These people are all sick. I mean, the whole government, for the most part, is perverted. There's pedophilia running rampant. You notice how all that has sort of gone by the by? You know how things get shoved under the rug? People move on, they forget. Problem is, I don't forget. It doesn't look like Wiley forgets either. You want to watch this clip. You want to listen to what Bill Maher has to say. You want to pass this along to your like-minded friends. You want to repost this in all your social media accounts. It's absolutely sickening. We've got to start all over again, folks. Our Congress is a complete mess. Our Senate is a complete mess. And it looks like past presidents are perverted pedophiles. I don't think Billy Bob was. He liked screwing too many women. But doesn't say that Hillary didn't enjoy the company of young underage women. She too traveled on Jeffrey Epstein's Lolita Express, as did Bill Clinton, but he went down for the women. Don't know what Hillary went down for. You know who else traveled on the Lolita Express? President Donald J. Trump, according to the flight records. Absolutely nuts, as did Alan Dershowitz. Matter of fact, if I'm not mistaken, Alan Dershowitz also defended Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> Are you sort of getting clued in? Thanks for listening. Pass this one along. Repost it in all your social media accounts.
totally insane. You might want to send a copy to George W. Bush. He is one real sicko. 9-11. He'll go down in history as being instrumental. As will Dick Cheney. As will a whole lot more than that. They were in that administration, Condoleezza Rice, just to name a few. Again, I transgressed. I apologize for that. It's so easy to do.